the, I'm going to call them the hockey puck stick windows, just because they resemble a hockey puck, uh, hockey stick, is the administration building. Okay, so if you pick up from where the dark gray changes to the white, and it, and it runs down to the, the next, uh, past that, past that um, where you can see the open steel up at the top of the truss area, up at the top of the building. Yes, sir. That's 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 the that's phase one. That's the uh, that's the fab that, that's going to go online first, and then from south of that, actually, south, yeah, north of that, that line there where you see the studs, that's phase two, and that's a third of the size of the uh, of the original fab that they're building. As you can see, this is how the this is how the workers, the majority of the workers, enter right through here. Safety trailer and first aid trailer on the left. Okay, this this is the backside of the of the fab and the expansion end. You can see what it's made up is really three segments. You got the east east side or west side rather, and that's the dirty side, and you got the middle, which is the clean, and then you have the the far side, which is where the air handlers are. This here is the uh, electrical service building. The um, switch gear and the high voltage yard is up here on the right. the gas yard and this building here that we're approaching is the cub which is a central utilities building where all of the all the gases come through and the, now you've seen the fab again as on the other side we'll come down and come between the two buildings shortly all right this is this is where the, all of the chill water processed water cooling water all come across on these trestles and they come into the building and they'll run up alongside and into wherever they need to go as far as that they use for, for uh, services. What you're going in right now is this is this is a solvent room and believe it or not we're going to be done with this for Monday to turn it over to the uh, to Air Liquide to do their work in here so a lot of work left to do in a short period of time. Eric's the guy that's going to make this place all ready by Monday. <laughs> I hope so. <laughs> now what we're walking in is into is in the subfab. Uh, just take a little walk down here so you get a, an idea of the size. Go across here. You can see all the piping, duct work. All the material that's basically stored in here is, is, is only supposed to be in here for three days and then it's supposed to be installed. So you get an idea how much work has to go on every day. Basically what you're looking at is six, six football fields in area. Okay, these are the uh, these are all the scrubbers. You want to get a good size. That that duck is 100 inches wide. Yeah, I got you in the shot, so we got some scale to it. Okay. That that's 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 the clean room, or where the clean room is going to be, in one of its more basic stages, huh? What you, see, that what you see right there is, in order to go and work beyond these curtains, you need to go in, and at that, the other side of that wall is, le is level three. It means you have to have booties on and uh, rubber gloves. You need to wipe your hard hat off before you go in. 
and then the next level up is level four, which means you have to You want to you want to keep in mind that right now what you're looking at is is just one sixth of the size of the of the clean room. All right, let's shut it off. Probably uh, there's 1,800 people here working today. Get a sight. Yeah, you want to take a shot out at the uh, new construction? I thought we were at the back. Yeah, at the back, yeah. Okay, that's 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 going to be the extension. So. You gotta enter from the west side to get to the gallon side. No, no, but on this side, I can't get, oh, I can't get up from this floor? No, you can't get from this floor. You have to go down to the third level okay. where you just came from and go to the gallon area. Uh, how are you? Good, how are you? Oh, living the dream. Good there. <laughs> I'm yeah. looking good, good. <laughs> Well, these are all exhaust fans. My name's Alan Cullion. I'm the general superintendent for M plus W Group, uh, building this plan here for Global Foundries. We're glad you took the time to come out and see it and hope you like what you saw.